Hey guys, how are you today? So I'm going to try to, going forward, do like once a month, do a favorite thing. Um, sometime, most of the time it will probably be, probably be a favorite art thing, but I can't guarantee it always will be. <laughs> it might be something else occasionally, but this month is definitely sort of an art thing. And this is the Arc Punch uh, by Staples. This is my new favorite thing. Yes, I finally broke down and bought myself an Arc Punch. Um, it is the most heavy, reading the reviews, it's the most heavy duty um, disc binding punch out there. You can do um, thicker papers with it, multiple sheets of paper without it uh, breaking or, or um, uh, binding up. Um, it is kind of big and bulky and it's not super cheap, but if you have a Staples Rewards card, save up some re rewards money to get it. And um, it is big, but it does have this lock on it. So if I unlock it, then the handle comes up so that I can use it and punch with it. But when it's in storage, I can push the handle down and lock it. And I have to say, the disc binding system in general is my new favorite thing, but this arc punch is definitely... Um, I have a lot of punches, and I like planner punches and binder punches in particular. And this one is really nice. The, and the disc binding system is... I have a Zutter bind it all, which I like. This is way easier to use. Um, and this um, Staples one has a guide here, so if you're not doing a full length of 8.5 by 11 paper, you're doing something smaller, you can move this guide up and down and line it up so that when you put your smaller pieces of pa piece of paper in, you just back it up to the guide and punch, and every time that you do that, it's going to all come out the exact same. Plus it has a little drawer down here, and all the little punchy bits. There you go. All the little punchy bits go in the drawer. And I did get some um, rings. Now, uh, most of your ring binding systems, you can use um, rings from different systems with the same binding. The arc is no different. So these are the arc rings, which I can get at Staples. You can use Happy Planner rings. Um, with this and the arc ones really don't come in as many fun colors as the happy planner rings do but they will all work I got it specifically so that I could do this <laughs> so I'm not going to tell you exactly why I did this until October but I will share with you what I did um, this is a planner sticker uh, book um, I used the ring binding system to make it and um, in it I am able to flip and I have all my planner stickers here, or a good selection of them, and I can just pull a sticker off, stick it in my planner, and then fold it up. It's much easier than looking through the bigger store bind, bind, uh, blah, 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 storage binder that I have, which I still like for the bulk of my stickers, they're in there. But when I'm just looking for a planner sticker to put in my planner or in one of my um, other journals, I don't want to dig through the binder and have to dig the binder out every time. So I have this smaller little book that can live on my desk that I can just flip it through real quick and go, oh yes, I want a bunny sticker. Um, and I have this thing for Korean planner stickers, in case you haven't noticed, and Hida stickers. Um, so I really enjoyed making this very much. I put a clear plastic cover on the front, which is actually a flexible cutting mat from the Dollar Tree. And they come really big. Too. You get two of them for a dollar, so check them out in the kitchen aisle. Um, and they punch like a dream on the arc punch, which is something else. I wanted to be able to punch this kind of stuff on that without too much trouble and it punches this like a dream. Um, then I put a piece of card stock. This is from Webster's Pages before anybody asks. And I just have a couple things tucked inside. Um, but then I cut some smaller strips of paper that are the, the height of the book and they're about two and a half inches wide and I used a uh, tape runner to stick my planner sticker sheets to that little strip of paper. You can see it here. And I did it on both sides and I punched everything and stuck it in the album. And now I have a really great planner sticker album. This is not my original idea. I saw somebody do something similar here on YouTube. I don't remember who it is. If you all know, let me know because I don't remember. Because um, we will definitely link her video in the description below. But I don't remember who it was. But I thought it was such a genius idea that I did it with my stickers. And I think it's fabulous. And it's going to... 
work really well going forward and why I did this like I said we will discuss going forward in October um, and or November and um, yeah so my favorite thing this month my arc punch so I will try to include a link in the description below to where to get this if you don't have a staples nearby um, so that you can order one if you would like to start getting into the ring disc binding or ring binding system I don't know what disc binding maybe you call it I don't know it's really handy um, it works like a dream and wow I don't know why I didn't do this earlier that's it for today don't forget the most important thing go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it maybe do something for somebody else too they probably do too all right that's it for today see you later bye